Science. Meet the Wendelstein 7X Stellarator. It looks like a mad scientist's project, and it sounds like one too. This machine is the world's largest nuclear fusion reactor, and it aims to generate energy in the same way as the atoms in the sun. Scientists at the Max Planck Institute in Germany are testing the beast to see if models like these could someday provide us mortals with an unlimited and clean source of electricity. A typical nuclear power plant, a fission plant, creates waste, nuclear waste, that has to be stored for tens of thousands of years. With fusion, we don't have that problem. Nuclear reactors typically produce energy by breaking down atoms. A fusion reactor, like the Stellarator, instead attempts to fuse atoms together. But this requires temperatures of more than 100 million degrees, so the fuel, a hydrogen plasma, better not touch the walls. As a result, Stellarators are extremely sophisticated. This one took nine years to build. This here is preventative science. It's like planting trees. If you don't plant your trees now, then you won't have any in a hundred years. You have to think ahead. Most fusion reactors are donut-shaped tokamaks, like in this experimental plant being built in southern France. The key is to create a powerful magnetic cage to contain the hydrogen as it reaches devilishly hot temperatures. The Stellarator, designed in Germany, has even more twists and turns to make it easier to keep this plasma under control. Scientists have just tested it and are pleased with its performance. They hope it will revive talks around nuclear fusion as a clean source of power.